So I primarily do criminal defense and personal injury, so I'm in court every single day, three times a day, four times a day. And so typically it's been um, where um, you haven't had a lot of minorities in the courtroom, uh, but that's changing. Um, there was one courtroom that I was in where the judge, the prosecutor, the public defender, and even the bailiff were all females, and the only male was the court clerk, which is the opposite of the way that it used to be. Um, so I'm seeing a lot of uh, females, I'm seeing a lot of minorities. Um, and I kind of predicted that because uh, in my classes that I'm teaching at Cooley, I'm seeing that the, the percentage of females, the percentage of minorities has substantially uh, been increasing. And then now, three, five, seven years later, we're seeing that actually in the courthouse with the prosecutors and the judges and, and other personnel. So that, that's one major change that I've seen with the face uh, of the law and who's actually practicing law. Yeah, I think that it comes down to advocating for certain rights. And if you're not part of that community, if you're not part of that um, that group that identifies in a certain way or part of that gender, um, then it's hard for you to understand their specific problems. But if you get someone like that into the legal profession that's going to advocate on behalf of that group, uh, then that helps change the laws, it helps change um, the way the laws are implemented. There's so many effects um, that it has positive um, on the entire community, uh, the legal community and outside of the legal community to have someone from those groups have a voice um, at the table. And we see that with women right now with uh, you know so many movements now um, because they've um, really become empowered, they're starting to dominate in, uh, in, in all kinds of fields, in the legal fields, in the medical fields. Uh, we're seeing that happen where they're out front, they're leaders now. Um, and the legal field was really behind every other field, but it's starting to slowly develop. Um, I see it again at the courthouse. Most of the prosecutors are females. Um, a lot of the defense attorneys are. Um, the judges are probably at about 50-50 now in Hillsborough County. So that's really uh, a development recently within the last maybe 10 years that's happened. And then we'll continue to see that with other minority groups as well.